So the only thing I would recommend buying is Bitcoin. The crypto stuff is all a scam. Learning a skill is very important. This idea that you're going to make bedroom beats and make YouTube videos and become a millionaire, the next celebrity, you're going to be the next Lil Xan or whatever. It's all in your imagination. This is not really going to happen. I asked you what coin I should invest in based on the vibe that you got. And I said, don't look into it. Just tell me. I should probably sell all that. Hello, Sam. That's how he wrote it. That's his intonation that he was intending there. I'm a little late to the game. Not a day one fan by any means, but a fan regardless. <clears throat> I know you get a plethora of finance questions, but I bet mostly a bunch of neats who lack the willpower to implement said advice. You mean lack the balls to put it all on the line and gamble? Because <laughs> that's how I've made money is from, from gambling. Yeah, you play a lot of poker. I put it you, all uh, out there. You gamble on bocce. No, literally, I put... Um, you do, uh, what was it called? I would Bit say Buster? that everything I've, almost everything I've done has, has been just gambling. Bitbuster? Bitbuster. Scratchies. Bit crusher. Scratchies. Scratchies. Uh, CSGO skins. In all seriousness, the, the, the cryptocurrency shit and the... Um, uh, I'm invested in a... I'm doing this angel investment thing. It's all gambling. Oh, you're, you're doing that? Yeah, I'm doing that. But it's it's extremely risky. How's it? How, do you has know? yielded nothing. Really? And it has cost everything. <laughs> if we get here tomorrow, it's empty. <laughs> Could you be. You don't have a phone anymore? Could be. Sold everything off. You're just in the park with the crackheads? I put, um, I picked out stocks because I read about them on, um, because I, re I read, I didn't even read the articles. I saw them in headlines. And I said, my gut says this is good. That's what I did. And I, I lost, doubled it. I lost $2. I made like $40,000. That's cool. In like six months. I remember you asked me one time, what, sh what coin should I invest in? I asked you, what did I say? You said, what coin should, should you invest in? Yeah. And you said, don't look into it or anything, just tell me. The, is, that, is that being picked up on the audio? Probably, yeah. So I had I had uh, jo I had Joey. I asked you what coin I should invest in based on the vibe that you got, and I said don't look into it. Just tell me, and then I put money into that. I think. Did you get? Did you make? I can't money? remember. <laughs> but I literally picked stocks because I said the vibe coin. Because I said, hmm, that seems that sounds yeah, that's the ticket. No idea. I no just nothing. look at on Robinhood. I look at the the little graph preview, mm -hmm. and I'm like, oh, that's going up. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That's <laughs> that looks good. Up. Um, I look, or I look for stocks that like just became available like last week. I should probably sell all that shit. Let me take a look at what it's at. Actually, it's legitimately. Don't want to forget. Charles Schwab. Excuse me. Investing um, seems not fun. Um, like investing in stocks. I'd rather, I don't know. I'd rather make money doing, doing something. I bought Alibaba. Google, Apple, Baidu, Casper Sleep. Did Casper Face make you any money? Yeah. It did? Yeah. Facebook, IBM, Neo, NVIDIA, Peloton. I better sell that quick. Tencent, Tesla, Walmart. No, just wait for the next wave of lockdowns and then Peloton. I, gotta, I think I gotta sell all that before, this, before Biden gets elected. Um... Money. I've worked Investment actively ability. to implement a lot of the mindset stuff you've talked about, but I still feel hemmed in financially in general in regards to the to the overhead of making anything digital. I'm torrenting my design programs with a shitty computer, but that's beside the point. I've been pretty broke my whole life. Steady job. Make $12. Recently got a work bonus and put it all into crypto, hoping that I can maybe... Make some money off Ether and Chainlink. We'll keep learning as much shit as I can. Thinking a little about carpentry hustle on the side, tables and shit, maybe transition back into labor. I'm 21, didn't go to college, got a relatively clear idea of what I want to do creatively. Um, the main point is I missed your initial Ethereum advice when it came out. I want to be able to make and spend big boy money like you, which I can't, that's not true. And I understand that work in equals money out with a little bit of luck and smarts, but it's hard to go from what feels like nothing to something. Where do I go from here? What do I do next? How do I start making actual money? Please and thank you. Um, the crypto stuff is all a scam. It's all a scam. Okay, and if you are, um, <clears throat> if you're in, the, if you're on the winning side of the scam, that's good. Uh, but, um, you could just as easily be on the losing side of the scam if you're holding holding the bag, as they say, 
when they uh, when they dump all their shit. I don't think that's a I don't think, I think that's a um, a virtuous a virtuous way to make money. I don't think it's a good idea. I don't think I think it's like playing with fire. I think it's a bad idea. So the only thing I would recommend buying is Bitcoin. I would not recommend around with these other little altcoins. The altcoin shit, the Wild West days of making a making a coin and having money appear out of thin air. Um, that is generally over, and that was over. That's been over for, over for years. Damn man, I remember buying some little peanut shit thing, name coin, and wa and then waking up two weeks later, forgetting that I bought name coin, and then seeing some crazy amount of money that from name coin, and then losing it uh, on uh, feather coin. Or whatever. Feather coin. I those forgot were, about Feather Those were crazy-ass days. Anyway. That was like, what, 2017? Like right know. before Bitcoin blew up. I don't remember, but it's all done. Um, <clears throat> so the, 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 thing, the only thing, I think Bitcoin has the chance to um, uh, replace partially gold as a store of value for millennials and Gen Z tech-minded people. Um, and I think, I do think Bitcoin is technically fascinating i think the lightning network network is fascinating i think um nick zabo is uh one of the smartest people in the world but all the other stuff i would not be around with ethereum and with anything else with with money that's um uh more than play money if it's money that you can't afford to to lose i wouldn't be doing that um as far as money goes, being 21 and being think and thinking about this stuff, you're well ahead of the curve. I think that's a very good thing. If you're 21 and you're already thinking about, you're already in panic mode about uh, about how to uh, how to achieve and how to believe. I think you're ahead of the curve. For most people, making making a skill or learning a skill is very important because you're not going to be this idea that you're going to make bedroom beats and make YouTube videos and become a millionaire, the next celebrity, you're going to be the next little Xan or whatever. This is all in your imagination. Like how that's your reference every time. It's all in your imagination. This is not really going to happen. You are not going to become the next uh, Smoke Perp or what is, what's the guy's name? Lil Pump. Lil Pump. You're not going to be the next Lil Pump. That's not going to happen. You're going to be the next um, uh, Lil Schmump. <laughs> that's the guy you never heard of because he makes $1 an hour working at the toilet factory. Okay, you're gonna be the next little schmump. That's what you're gonna be. Um, so for most people, carpentry, not that I would know, but uh, selling cars, welding, whatever, whatever the f you can do, being a dealer at a blackjack table at your local casino, anything else other than making beats is uh, what, I would, what I would recommend. Now, if you wanna make actual money, you have to find a way to make money that doesn't involve selling your time. Because even if you become a bankruptcy lawyer, even if you become the highest paid bankruptcy lawyer in Manhattan, okay, you're still going to be selling your time. Even if you're invoicing clients for $2,000 an hour, you still have to put in hours to make that money. What you want to do instead is you want to have income streams that do not require you to put your time into it so that you can use your time to get more income streams. It's called passive income. It's called passive income. And you want to also be thinking about long tail passive income. I'm still making money, your money, from sales of Kickstarter TV One, which is from 2014. Okay, there you go. 2014 Kickstarter TV is still selling to this day. Ring in the cash register, bringing in the bucks, your bucks, unless you torrented it, in which case don't call yourself a fan of mine. I don't want to hear that. If you're torrenting my shit, be ashamed, okay? If you have zero dollars, you can watch the clips on YouTube that I graciously allow to stay up. But please don't torrent shit. <laughs> or do whatever you want. I don't think anyone's going to have your voice ringing through their head. I don't care. They're gonna torrent your shit. It's okay. They can torrent. If you're poor, just torrent. Steal. You're not gonna get your money regardless. If you're poor, you can steal from me. That's fine. You can steal my time, and my labor. I'll allow that. If you have money. Anyway, my point is, <clears throat> if you can make five income streams like that that make you money automatically ten years after the fact, anything like that, 
That's what you want. That's what you really want. Because then you have your time freed up to go chase after more shit. That's how you make, not necessarily big boy money, um, which I wouldn't know how to make big boy money, but that's how you make money that lets you freeze up your life to do fun stuff like this podcast.